she had been a charity-minded noblewoman named Diana. Your golden mark burned. Another memory appeared. A charming, hooded vagrant begging for food. And she has another quest. My heal is upgraded. Nice. So, that's what I like to hear, Nate. Get <laughs> away, people. <laughs> yeah. I have to examine the body. Which is over here somewhere, I believe. And it should be the monolith to take the rug in it. Yeah. Yes, it is. And the body's here as well. The more Marion spoke of Lucius, which she did often, crediting him with the carnage you saw, the more memories seemed to fill your head. It was clear they were Rihanna's. She apparently used her family's wealth to run a soup kitchen for the city's poor. You saw the smiling vagrant begging for food from the soup kitchen every day. And heard Iana eventually chastise him for being able-bodied, but relying on charity. With a laugh, he handed her two tickets to a play in a local theater. As more memories flashed, you shared Iana's realization this man was Lucius Quinto, a famous playwright. Could this be Marion's Lucius? What kind of playwright could commit such carnage? Especially one who seems so charming. I'm guessing we're going to fight Lucius at some point. At some point, I should imagine you. Yeah. Oh, the body has a quest. <laughs> I used to do that at school. Did you? Yeah. We used to do grave rubbings. Grave, yeah, grave rubbings. Yeah. All those thousands of years ago. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, you get some of this way, the first one? Yeah. That's the only time I seem to get any like like a, it's like is it like a rubber banding? Yeah, sort of like my screen's like yeah, it's stu right stutters. Yeah, yeah, when you when you're sprinting, that's a bit weird. Okay. Um. This should be the wasps or something, I think. Is it? Uh, it's a sheep. Bees, yeah. Yeah, kill ranch sheep bees or something. Carnivorous bees, he's out here. Yeah. Well, at least these aren't taken. To turn in a quest, even without finishing why would why would you do that? Why would you turn in your quest it, early? We'll receive a smaller experience reward. Uh, because you don't have to do all the you don't have to do everything. So if you're having a hard time killing like a named mob, you don't have to. Uh, you don't necessarily have to fight it. All right. Do 
Did you pull that by accident then? I don't think I did. Alright. <laughs> Maybe I did, but I, I don't think I did, because I just used my heels. That's it, report to Shepard. Yeah, it's glitchy when I'm sprinting, you're yeah, right. Yeah, yeah, it is, it's weird. Yeah, it's fine all the time apart from then. Or is it supposed to happen like that? Oh, that could be. Right, report to Gilbert, that must be in the town, I think. Ah, oh, is this the one where you have to uh, go into the house? I think it is. Yes, maybe. This one here, Mayor. Except. Look yeah. inside the model home. Yeah, lucky side model home. All you have to do is go inside it. Get out of my way. Did it put something? No, that's it. Just have to go in. Oh! What was that? <laughs> Take a seat, mate. I'm tired. I'm exhausted. <laughs> Get out of my way. This is more like what I was talking about, how there's this many people. The blood hats in another a topic of conversation in Soulsry for years. They were known as a secretive association of assassins with dealings at all levels of society. The group's motives were shrouded in mystery. But rumors spoke of religious fanaticism and a plot to rule the Crescent Throne. Blamed for a spate of kidnappings, they became the region's boogeymen. A reason for children to fear the dark, and for parents to secure their homes at nightfall. Of course, these everyday phobias belied the true horror of the organization. They had allegedly assassinated the last king, and had grown very dangerous and powerful. You wondered if they'd had any historical precedent in Iana's time. However, her memories held no mention of these dark assassins or their trademark crimson gloves. Okay. And here's a quest. Oh. Report to General Gorbanon. Oh, I've got another quest there. There's Gilbert. Shield slam upgraded. Yay! I'm guessing that. Here. Chop down sturdy trees to collect sturdy logs. I suppose I'd better deliver this fall first, haven't we? <laughs> oh yeah, where's this fall at? Uh, that's number two, so that's over this way. Oh, this is raising your horse. This is where we get our horse, Nate. Now oh, the elves get uh, an elk. Yeah. Uh, I'll have a great one, of course. 
Right, plant a fight. Plant a vita seed. Is that anywhere, right? Yeah. Or is the vita root? Yeah, I have to wait for it, I think. And there is the first gold seller. Oh yeah, I saw one before. <laughs> Unbelievable, aren't they? But all you do is right-click their name and you can instantly block them. Can you? Yeah, it's really nice. Oh yeah, there we go. Alright, get the Vita root. Report back to Wyatt. Raise a brown, raise a horse. Oh, there you go. Amuse the baby. How do you, uh, call your horse? How do you what? How do you bring up the horse? Uh, right click it in your inventory. Oh, there it is. Eat it. Maybe a Urgh, get him away. <laughs> oh, I need water. Yeah, go to the well. Draw water. More water. Yeah, you should have had enough, I think. There's not enough water. Where is my... Oh, there we go. Give one. <laughs> I'm going to dance for it. <laughs> On bingo. Right click the mount icon in your bag to summon it. Right, bring that down to the hot bar. Absolutely ridiculous. Why am I dancing for a horse? <laughs> oh. Okay, got a horse. Now you have to sort that guy again. Yeehaw! 